Safest College in the Country. This award belongs to Clemson University, which boasts the lowest number of crimes per 1,000 students. But this title doesn't make Clemson immune from safety issues on campus. Talking with faculty, students, and staff will help uncover the true nature of safety on Clemson University's campus. Clemson University is tucked away in Pickens County, South Carolina, and is home to 23,406 students, in addition to the 5,268 faculty and staff members that keep Clemson running smoothly. Maintaining safety at a school this size is quite an operation. Luckily, Clemson has several programs and services in place to do just that. When we talk about safety and security issues, and those things have to be delineated in a way that is all-encompassing throughout all areas of the university. Here at Clemson, we have uh, municipal services. It is incredibly unique in that we have police, fire, and rescue. Fire and Emergency Medical Services is a branch of Clemson University's Department of Public Safety within the Division of Student Affairs. Fire and EMS are dedicated to providing a safe campus environment for faculty, staff, students, and visitors. Similarly, the Clemson University Police Department is also a Division of Student Affairs and currently has a station located in the heart of the Athletic District. They frequently have training sessions for faculty, staff, and students. Uh, the Clemson Police Department put on an active shooter training, uh, and I was a little I was a little hesitant about that. I mean, that's something that that seems really really heavy to go to. But what I found out was that there's really really uh, plenty of ways that you can react and help people stay safe even in a crisis situation. Through practice, through drills, through training exercises the Clemson University Police Department have done that their response time to anything on campus is under two minutes. Our Dean on call works very very closely um, with police fire and rescue because when they get a call then we get a call. Clearly Clemson has emergency services well established. But how do they communicate with the broader Clemson family? Talking to one student led to some interesting insights. Uh, I get alerts mainly through email and texts. Uh, the majority of the time it's, it, it's usually tests, but when it's actually necessary, it's super helpful. Um, a lot of the times I'll get notifications when a storm is coming, when you know there's a uh, building that's being shut down, if there's like a chemical leak or anything that's going on on campus that student needs to be student needs to be aware about. I actually had not used the CAT bus system or Tiger Transit up until this year, but now that I'm uh, I don't have a car on campus and I'm living off campus, it's extremely helpful to use. I I've, I've really appreciate all the things they do and when they go above and beyond to make sure everyone's safe. So yeah, it's three years I've not had one instance where I've felt unsafe. These candid interviews provide a real-life perspective of what campus safety looks like at Clemson University, a never-ending struggle that will constantly challenge our vigilance. Safety issues must be taken seriously across both college campuses and schoolyards. Reporting from Clemson University, this is Jay Smith, Clemson News Now.